This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Welcome to the 10 a.m. news, folks. I am Jacob. Uh, today we have the indices, the, the Dow and the SPX down modestly, NDX up modestly. Uh, gold is taking the hit today. The GDX is down significantly. Uh, let's see here. The dollar is up almost at the 104 mark. We'll see what happens with that. Uh, Tesla down a little bit from its pump up, but uh, I'm expecting that's going to continue to go up. Uh, Apple obviously up. We have Meta up modestly. We'll talk a little bit about TikTok. And I know Tommy was just speaking about it on the last uh, show. But I think there's some more to add we could talk about. Uh, the bank's down modestly. Today, I, I want to focus on as well when we get to the show, which I'm filling in for Basil. We're talking about NVIDIA. Um, I was speaking about it yesterday. We were at the 298 level, and this pumped straight up above 300, uh, which is a nice level it had to break there. And it is sitting comfortably at 307 to 308 right now. And so we'll kind of take a look a little bit more into that. And I have kind of a nice uh, quote from some CEOs from the dot-com crash uh, that, that can kind of give us insight of what's going on, at least regarding like the PE ratios on these kind of companies. Today, I want to talk a little bit about Cisco. So we're going to go into their uh, quarterlies, uh, their earnings, and then see why they're still falling. Um, I want to talk a little bit about corporate espionage. Folks, we have... We have everything today for the show, so seriously, stay tuned. Uh, another thing we have is a nice, interesting paper about um, international tax avoidance by multinational firms. It, and guys, it's always so important to kind of understand what the, the landscape is for these kind of things. It's just so important to understand uh, the, the macro factors that affect all of us. Even if we're day trading, even if, you know, whatever your angle is, it's always important to understand these kind of macro factors and these little... Um, you know, kind of quirks that exist in the markets. We'll talk a little bit about um, gas, oil, um, some new stuff was found in Brazil, which is pretty big. And uh, yeah, stay tuned, folks. Uh, we will be back in a few minutes, so stay tuned.